Hello, my name is Lexi Tabert, and this is my recommendation for the redesign of the Boston Home Partners lobby, conference room, and mail room. To get started, I created a look and feel board which would help me direct my design throughout the designing process. I gained knowledge of the Hill and Partners style by looking at their website and the past exhibits they provided to us. I wanted something that represented the brand, but also pushed the boundaries of what they currently had. With the space that we were given, I worked on a few different arrangements. However, in the end, I felt I could best utilize the space with the pre-existing layout. I did change a couple walls, but overall, the space is the same layout as before. This view is the first thing guests will experience when they enter the space. They'd be greeted by the front desk employee and directed from there. This view displays how the warm tones of the wood interplay with the cool grays of the surrounding space to create a cohesive look and feel. The back wall is all rounded to elongate the space and trick the eye to make it seem bigger and very encompassing. Up top, I created a suspended MDF ceiling structure that in its original purpose is for sound barriers. However, I felt the orientation of the faux and the structure was very interesting and different for guests to look at. This factor in the design would help reinforce the idea that Hill & Partners doesn't miss any details and make sure that all parts of the projects are perfect. This back wall is rounded at the corner with an LED screen that will stretch the entire length of the wall. This content on the screen can be static to specifically Hill & Partners branding, or when a large client or prospecting customer would be visiting, the screen can be switched out and geared towards that specific client. This LED panel would offer the lobby space an element of timelessness as the content and use of the screen could, con be, could be continuously switched out for years to come. To the left of the reception desk area would be a small sitting area for any guest to wait for their meetings. When discussing the typical wait time of a guest in this space, it was said to be around 5 to 10 minutes, so I knew that there was not a lot of time that I could expect guests to participate in any sort of activity. This is where I wanted to direct the seating area towards that LED panel so that they could watch what was going on. This is where my recommendation would be to possibly have past projects that Hill & Partners has done, meet the team, um, some sort of video content that people waiting in the lobby could enjoy. I changed the orientation of the wall between the conference room and the mail room to create a small nook that would house a refreshment area along with the Hill & Partners trophies. Since the guests only have a short time in the lobby, right above the refreshments would be shelves to hold all of the Hill & Partners trophies. This, while guests are getting refreshment, the trophies would be at an average eye height. This would help ensure that the guests see the awards and talents that Hill & Partners have put forth through the years. Inside the door to the left would be the mail room. Although this space wouldn't be visited by any customers or guests, it does need to be a functional space for employees to come and get supplies or fax any information. I purposely left the space very open because it is small and I didn't want it to get congested with packages and people coming in and all, all the time. Onto the last space of this project, we come to the main conference room. This is a back view of the space and the view really shows how I used MDF board textures along with other materials to create a visually appealing display without adding a bunch of physical elements. The bench system along with the entire wall created the bench system along the wall created a lot of seating area. It is also the same bench system that I put out in the lobby, so it creates a unification between the two rooms. I incorporated this view into my design process because I thought that it needed to be emphasis on the view at which your customers view the space when you're on a WebEx call. I incorporated the wood use from the lobby area and created a design that looks as if it was reaching out to the viewers on screen. With this view, it was my goal to give any viewer on the WebEx call a quick snapshot of the Hill & Partners brand within their space. Thank you for presenting this opportunity to us students at BSU. We really appreciate all the time and commitment that you all put forth. Thank you for listening.